everyone, it's Shin. Welcome back to my channel. And I know I haven't been here forever making a video about my hair growth update. And as you know, uh, just recently, I've had problems with my scalp, so um, I was trying to nurse it. But however, um, this week I have done the neem oil. I've done it uh, a few times. I kept it in for three, no, I would say two to three hours. And um, yeah, I, I've done it. And let's see if we see a difference. Um, yeah, so I've done the neem oil. Um, yeah, I was just trying to relax it for a while because my head was very, my scalp was very, very sensitive. And although I, I put aloe vera to kind of calm it down, uh, I still had some red spots. I called my dermatologist and my dermatologist wasn't in, so I couldn't go to the doctor to find out what the problem is. But I think I know what the problem is. Um, I'm just getting older. <sighs> Stress is a <laughs> and <laughs> this is life. I haven't gotten my period in two months. It's going on three months. My skin has been dry even though I think it looks better in a way I'm I'm seeing some wrinkles so I think I'm actually going through the whole process of becoming menopausal so I think that's what did it on top of the stress that I had um, so I've been learning to relax a little bit more and I've been feeling okay besides the freaking gas that I had all week long I said I, I talked about that in my live video, but I guess you're not here to talk about gas, are you? You want to see my head, and so I'm going to show you. Now, as you see, look, look, I have nothing in my hair. I can wear my hair up, which I love because I can actually give my scalp a chance to breathe without having any no track frontal in it or topper, which it doesn't really give me any tension anyway but just not to have anything on top of my hair is a plus. I do, however, have to be careful if I'm outside, even in the winter, with the sun, because it can go through these little thin hairs of mine and penetrate my scalp. And as you know, my scalp is no good for that. So when I do go out for a certain period of time, I do have to wear something. And it hasn't been that cold enough to wear a hat. So I've been wearing my no-track frontal, which is my little lifesaver. So without further ado, let's take this little bun thing off. <laughs> Another thing, my hair lately, this is why I feel like I'm going through some type of menopause something um, is because the ends of my hair have been very dry even when I condition it I still feel like it, it feels like a little bit like hay so I think I need um, like a, a supplement to take for my for my hair although my nails are growing look at my nails my nails are growing I have to say I've never had my nails this long in my life mm -hmm. so how are we go hair we go. <laughs> look, I mean, look, look how thick it looks. <laughs> Isn't that crazy? Like, I feel like I could actually go out. Look, nothing in my hair, nothing in my hair. I can just go like that. It, it's just crazy because what, what it, 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 it's just, is, it, I mean, really, this neem oil is it that good? Look at this, you guys. Look. Of course, I have, you know, the thinness over here, but I mean, look how much thicker. I mean, I don't have to sit here and disguise it or put any, um, like, eyeshadow or fibers on. I just feel like I can actually go out. Like, I could put my... I, I mean, I still wouldn't go out like this, only because that's just me. I just... People are just cruel... You know what I'm saying. You know the whole deal. But um, I can definitely put my hair up and just disguise this. As you can see, I can actually fix my hair to go to the side. And it really, it's not 
that visible and I love it. I do, however, have to take care of the bottom. But yeah, um, oh, another thing I wanted to address because a lot of you have said that you ordered neem oil and it looks like it was like coagulating down here. Now, I noticed that my neem oil started doing that and I have said this in a couple of, maybe my lives I've said it. So if you don't watch my lives, then I'll just say it here. Um, yeah, I have done research and it is about the temperature. So if it's too cold or too hot, it can change the property of the neem oil. All you have to do, like if you get that, it's not molded or anything. All you have to do is just shake it. See, you can see how it's like a little thicker there, see? It's like cloudy, that's okay. You just shake it up like so. Shake it up and it's fine, it's perfect. See, it has little pieces, I don't, you probably can't see, but it's got these little pieces just uh, in the neem oil. It will settle, it's fine, keep using it, don't worry about it. If it's solidified, maybe you should heat it up a little bit and put on your hair. I hear that's great as well. So anyway, so this is my update. I'm feeling fine. I feel like I lost a little weight. But anyway, um, that's my update. And let me know what you guys think down below. Um, I don't know. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling good. Let me know how you're doing with the neem oil or any other oil that you're using. And uh, pretty soon, just keep watching um, because I am going to be doing a, another neem oil giveaway. If you want to order the neem oil, I will put the link down below. Please feel free to order it through my link down below. And that's it. I will see you guys on Friday for my other updates. And keep watching. And I love you guys. See you in my next video.